All right, survey says, it says motor not responding. That's 14. 47 was left, uh, left door traveled too far. And I think 54, one of the two, get them mixed up, uh, says that it's not responding. And one says it's not traveling. And the other one says that it is, uh, not working all right and just like the camera stand it is not sitting where i want it to all right <clears throat> so keys out of the darn thing just as i expected we're, we're pulling this thing apart and i'm guessing that when i did hook it up it traveled too far and it binded on itself or something that's what i'm guessing so we're gonna pop this open and make sure this little guy is not you know bound up my little buddy there you go all right come to papa all right uh, i did this with a pick last time i think or a baby flathead and we're gonna have i'll have a little bit of room kind of give a The doors inside closing. Well, that's a good sign. Can you see what I'm doing? Yeah, kind of. This little guy. I might need, I think I used two screwdrivers last time, if I remember correctly. Might have to put a wedge in here to keep pressure. And there's that one, technically. As long as it keeps pressure and doesn't fall back into place. We'll be all right. Yeah, that one's open. All right. Oh, that one popped too. Wow, that was a little, a little too easy. It's scary how easy that was. All right, let's put one right here in pressure. Stay. Still in view? Yeah, you are. All right. Ooh. That one's a slight toughie. It almost looks like it's already popped the, the lip. There it goes. Is that us? It'll pop right back in place, of course. There it is. All right. That's right. And we're looking for anything jammed up, broken, any of the, of the above. And how did I pull this out last time? I think I just went straight up with her. go sweet Alabama All right. of course I've got the darn thing upside down somehow <sighs> flip it
Yay. All right, there's the goodies. I'd say the teeth look okie dokie. Whoa, kiddos. You can stay where you are. Actually, I am going to pull you out. And... Is the motor going to stay in there? Yes, it will. Alright, cool. <clears throat> Are we still in Zoom? Yep. Alright, good. Hey, hey, look at that, kids. All right. Viva no resistance. All right, cool. It spins pretty darn good. Still spinning. I think it's because it's still got power. Going to it. It's trying to shut itself. Daddy says, oh. Point. Yeah, it's not bad. Gotta smell it, too. Always gotta smell stuff. Doesn't smell bad. Just smells like lithium grease. All right, let's put her back together. Inspect the gears. Gears look, I mean, they look brand new because it's brand new. All right. How did baby go? Baby went like this. This one go to that one. I actually I think it did. I think this one went to that one right there. It's a puzzle. Yeah, it winds up with the worm gear. That's a worm gear right there. <laughs> Yay. No. That's not right, kids. Come on, I just literally had this thing apart. Oh well, I got a lot of stuff on my mind. It's got bigger teeth that would go this way. Oh, it doesn't fit on the rod either. That's what it was. It was upside down. Right? Right. Okay, that makes sense. I had everything the right way on the towel, the napkin that I had down here, but I guess this one flipped over upside down, so that's why it was doing what it was doing. Okay, we are locked in place. Off that residue. <coughs> Pop the cat back on. Yay. All right. We'll temp it in again. Make sure that we're all right. We're in good focus. <clears throat> all right. Darn thing should work. Trying to feel. 
I had it lined up earlier too. I mean, figures. Seriously? Oh, yeah, that's right, because I turned the gear dummy. That's why it's doing what it's doing. Okay, well, let's try to get that back to where it was. I gotta get this lined up right. <sighs> I'm gonna have to bump it. It's like bump starting a freaking car. Alright, unclip this. This is how we're gonna have to do it. <sighs> this reminds me of what you would do trying to get an ignition or the crankshaft to be top dead center. So it'd be easier to throw on like old engines or something that's not quite working. That's all working in there. because I had the, it unplugged with the key, possibly. There it goes. Hey, hey, hey. They're gonna unplug you real fast before you clock out. There you go. Yay, all right. It's almost in the position I need you in. Facing flat, you would be facing way not flat. Which angle is that? Really? There it is. Alright, but that's too far up. Darn it, Jim. And this would not do it either. No. Of course not. Huh. I'm going to have to clock it again. Darn it. Alright, well, good signs I got the motor running again and working. Go, 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 go. And we'll stop right there. And hopefully that does, you know, what it should. Yay! All right, there we go. That's better, better, better. Best part is I'm missing a screw that's down here. Whatever. Oh, there it is. It's under my screwdriver. I'm going to have to open up this garage when I do start this truck. The other day I started it for just a minute. And, woo, it stunk this garage up quick. This V8 puts out some emissions. Okay, here we go. Here's the test. And we're still, you know, we're, we're, I've kind of got you over here. Over there, let's... Ooh, don't fall, Bubba. All right, let's try this, and hopefully it clocks itself. Yay, all the way up. Should go beep, beep, beep. Then all the way down. Does it seize?
Yay! That's what I want to see. Now stop when it hits it. Awesome. Awesome. Two for two, baby. All right, now back to the heat. Awesome. Very nice. Oh, yay! Okay, now let's see if we can split the diff. Bring it down. See if I can get that door halfway. All right, I gotta find that magical number. I imagine 70 degrees would be Nix, would be the magical number. No. Okay. 70 degrees is not the Nix. Come down, come down. 63 degrees, come on, you should even start working. It also might not do it because the temperature of the vehicle and the heat that would be coming out of the thermostat telling that it's things are coming down. Now let's stop right there. Oh, 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 oh. So it is. Alright, so it's full throttle. I just come to learn. Alright. So it ain't going all the way down until that thermostat starts reading of air coming out, air coming in. And then it would know it's high and low action. Now this function right here shouldn't work at all. The right, it said that it wasn't going to. Because it takes it from a dual climate control to a sing single. Yep, alright. Yeah, the master only works. Driver's side. And that's what they said in their disclaimer. And that's okay, you know, that's better than... Not freaking working at all. Yeah, I'm just seeing. I'm just gonna put that on low. No, it should go on high. Yeah, might as well because we're in winter. Oh, sweet Jesus. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I'm talking about. It makes me so happy. <sighs> so happy. All right. Let's get down here. I wonder what you're yelling at me for. Yay. Got good grease in the bad boy. Yepper, yeppers. You can even see the rust in there. I've, I've scrubbed it though, I mean, it's gotten more lovin's than it's seen in its life. Alright, now that I've got that like that, let's see if I can give you guys some live action. Am I hitting the right button? as a Cadillac. Sweet. You see how it came down? It went down, then boop, back up. I think it's clocked itself correctly. So it doesn't go too far. It doesn't burn up that worm gear, I'm guessing. What is this? Just some garbage that kind of like, you know, fell down. Ah, uh, I know what that is. That's probably the incoming, or the exhaust. Yeah, the, it's be correct, that would be the exhaust of the heater core, I would imagine, because it would be the hot, the hot side. And then the incoming would be the cold. One or two, I forget. All right, let's, uh, let's kick open up a garage door. Am I going to keep you where you are? Are you going to fall? 
I'm not doing the best shot. We're going to work with that. All right, let me go open up the garage door and make sure. Oh, I got a kitty in here. Hmm. I need to get this kitty out of here, technically. Huh. Kitty! Pull her back. Let her sit for a second. Dead battery. That that scared the shit out of me. Something told me that was going to happen. I literally haven't started the car in quite a few days. Yes. Okay. Somehow I need to jump this truck. <laughs> Oh, this is a nightmare that's coming true. I knew this was going to happen to me. That's awesome. Isn't that awesome? That's great, isn't it? Pretty great. Mm. Yep, that is a doornail. That's, that's fucking sweet fucking... Oh, and now I'm cussing. Cussing in my video. That's not what I'm supposed to be doing. Huh. <sighs>